Welcome to Tactical Reviews and in this video we're going to take a look at a couple of really nice EDC products from Big Eye Design and this is inspired by uh, a pen that I bought from them which is a, a bolt action universal refill um, pen I've got the copper version but that's not the main subject of this review instead we have their Thai EDS2 and it's the everyday screwdriver and it's the second version uh, along with their Thai EDC wrench. So let's first of all take a look at the EDS2. So here we are the big eye design, eye for idea, and this is the EDS, but just before we start opening that and looking at it in more detail, so in the packaging which slides out and in the end section, uh, this is typical of, or at least the, the three big eye design products that I've uh, actually had myself uh, there's a little section on the end to hold any spares or accessories so inside spare parts and that is a one eighth of an inch allen key so just pop that back in which has got a, a magnetic closure as well so in fact what I'm going to do is let's, let's unpack the the wrench as well and then we'll zoom in and take a closer look at both of them So again, packaging with a little spares section and the spare parts in this case are two small bolts or screws, presumably in case anything comes loose and is lost. Pop those back and here is the EDC wrench so with a really unique little sliding adjuster giving a sort of a, a ring spanner adjustment anyway that's just getting them out of their box I'm going to zoom in and we'll take a much closer look at both of these so we're back now with the EDS everyday screwdriver and the EDC wrench uh, and again a little guest appearance the bolt action the copper pen that I originally got it was an inspiration to have a look at more of these products so the first of the two we're going to take a much closer look at is the EDS2 so a really interesting design where it's very much like a liner lock knife but with a screwdriver instead of a knife so as we open that up little integral lock comes into place and means the screwdriver bit is held out, unlock like an integral knife and some of this action is created by a series of magnets inside the EDS um, just very quickly so between the original EDS and the EDS2 uh, there are two main differences uh, one of them is that the pocket clip 
is a deeper carry so the original the pocket clip started further down and now it's higher up so nice deep carry and the second major one is actually an additional bit holder that's been added into the screwdriver bit holder itself so you get an extra screwdriver bit so on the original you would have one in the main arm and two in the back here and now on the EDS2 you also have an additional bit held in the, the bit holder so as we look inside here you can see magnets so one long long magnet at the back the main purpose of which is to keep these bits in place and then a smaller magnet there which when this arm is closed it locks onto the bit and stops the bit both falling out and keeps the arm folded nicely so for the additional bit that's held in here what you do is push it out from underneath and then what you'll find is that it rotates out and in fact it's the magnet for the bit holder there that's keeping that in place so that's it already sort of held and just fold it inside so your main bit again just magnetic retention that's the magnet in there snaps into place and your additional bits so the stop pin here as well as providing the open position for the bit holder it also stops your additional bits from sliding out in that direction then assuming you are pocket carrying effectively you've got gravity as well as the magnetic retention keeping these bits which will then are able to come out ah, or oh, I forgot as well there's actually a, a little spring-loaded ball retention so that helps stop these bits from accidentally coming out Of course, these are standard, as marked here, quarter inch hex bits. So any that you have already, completely universal fit, you can take and you can choose to use with your EDS2. So just line that up, slide it in and we've got the magnetic holding it from moving too much the little ball detent and the bar stopping it at the end that's our two spare bits in there so a really lovely neat functional screwdriver with four standard quarter inch bits that can be held all titanium and working like an integral lock folding pocket knife so complementing this we have the adjustable wrench so I believe this was inspired from uh, an old sort of out of production design that's fallen by the wayside um, and reproduced in the modern world in titanium, beautifully made and providing you with a extremely pocket friendly adjustable wrench. 
So of course most adjustable wrenches have teeth sticking out, or the two arms and ends that are scratchy and damage things. So here we have effectively like a ring wrench, but one that is adjustable. And there are two scales provided. Let's pop that out of the way. So you have imperial and metric. And whether or not you would completely believe, you know, you set it to say, oh, I want 10 millimeters. So I've lined that up there. I mean, the nut itself might have a slight bit of variation, whatever. Once you put it on the nut, you might actually tighten it up onto it, which is something I would typically do with an adjustable wrench to make sure it's a really tight fit. All the way out to 19 millimeters or three quarters of an inch and all the way in to five millimeters or three sixteenths of an inch. Again, we have a pocket clip, reasonably deep carry, good strength in the ring, single piece of titanium, So there we have a very complementary set of EDC tools from Big Eye Design, the EDS2 Everyday Screwdriver and the EDC Adjustable Wrench. Thanks for joining me. Remember, get informed, be prepared, stay sharp.